So this is currently how my Jammy um, Pop Culture James Brown works. I just received him today. Uh, this is actually my uh, second one. Uh, I do have parts from my other one, which I'm going to um, try and use to restore this. But it should be an easy fix. Um, it's just his mouth. His mouth kind of works. Um, but I think the motor shaft piece might be on its way out. Um, also, um, the hips. The, the hips do have a split gear. You, you can hear the motor, and they also try to push to one side when... Uh, when you're having going. <laughs> so um, that that could also be an easy fix. I'll give you guys an update when uh, when I'm into this guy and getting some of his mechanisms all repaired. Okay, so I've never actually filmed a video of restoring one of these hip swinging jammy items before, um, but as you can see, this one. Um, your worst enemy really is these guys. You gotta make sure these do not fling anywhere when you seek these out. I've got three out of four out so far, but one of them did fling somewhere and I luckily found it. Um, but we got one of these and uh, um, just need to try and pry it out. I am using a flathead screwdriver. You probably could get away with it better using a more sharper tool or using scissors or something. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try get this one out and I'll show you what the mechanism looks like. Okay, so the mechanism is out, as you can see. The uh, two longer pins are for the lower body and the two shorter pins are for the upper body. Uh, that's just to remember there, but we've got both of them, all of them uh, washers out. And I'm going to put some hot glue over them once I've put them back in, just to give them the extra bit of security. But yeah, here is the mechanism. As you can see this, I think the gear is split. You can, it's very, uh, yeah, it's very temperamental. Like, <laughs> Well, the belt could be bad, it could be one of the two. I think the gear is split though. Um, for the head, the head look, sounds like it's disengaging from the gears in certain parts. I'm not sure if I do have that gear to spare though. So I'm hoping it could be the motor shaft, it might not be. Um, but at the same time, I can have, I'm can i gonna have a look and show you what the mechanism looks like for the head on this guy. Um, but first I'm gonna have a look at the hip swinging because that's where the main problem really, stick, really lies at. Okay. See so the screws are out on this uh, hip swing Mac. Um, I have took the um, took the knob off right here as well. Uh, that's in good condition. Uh, one thing I have noticed though is this piece right here is extremely yellowed, and um, usually it would be fine. Um, but when I was unscrewing it and everything, I uh, really didn't want to keep something this brittle on um, when everything's all white on this prop um, and perfect. Um, so thankfully, um, from my spare parts, James Brown, I do have a donor for that. So um, he's going to have a new uh, new back onto on this mechanism right here. Um, but anyway, to tell that this gear's split, this pulley will lift up very easily, just like that. And yeah, the gear is split in this Mac. So we're going to get this open and show you what the uh, culprit right is. Here are the gears. All of these do look in um, good shape, as you can see. Um, no teeth missing off them and from how it looks so that one is perfect square shaft doesn't rarely does have any issues on what on a gear this big um, but here is our culprit this there's our um, split tentative gear I do believe it, it does feel like there's a broken piece on that could be one of the, the teeth that I chipped um, but this gear is split it's not split as some could have been because like does hold together quite tightly still, but as you can see, uh, if it focuses, you can see a crack right there um, when I put that against the screwdriver. So that one is definitely split and uh, I'm going to replace that. The belt does look to be good um, wherever I've put that. Um, so that's all good. Um, so we're going to reassemble this mechanism and his hip swinging should be all back good as new. Okay, so his mechanism's back assembled, belt's back on, and uh, I'm going to show you where... Uh, so as you can see it's working really nicely one thing i have noticed you see how it's stopping um, during that activation there um for, i have actually spotted there is a loose back pass through and that wire all loose right there and as far as i know this has never been taken apart um just from how the hot glue looks and everything um, so that is one thing to always keep an eye on 
when you were uh, restoring these animatronics guys make sure that make sure that there aren't any loose wires or anything like this otherwise you will have problems in the long run once you put them back together so i'm gonna go and resolder this real quick and we'll check out the other mechanisms <laughs> There we go, a much better result right there. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, actually I'm gonna check out the head mechanism before we put this back together, cause why not? Um, you can see it is located right there. I think the only thing I might need to take out is the motor just to check the, uh, just to check the gear on there. Um, I don't, I, as far as I can see, I don't have any parts for the head, for the head mechanism going spare. So um, we'll, we'll have a look at this. Um, um, gear on the motor shaft and um, the head does move fine as it is so so um there's nothing really too wrong with it uh so here's the head motor it's actually a lot smaller than you would think for to run a head motor on one of these but it really does its job quite well and what i have noticed um it pops off very easily in fact so it does need another gear it looks like um which shouldn't be a problem so i'm gonna pop one on there and it should be all good Okay, so um, now on to James Brown's mouth. Um, so what we've done so far, I've took his mouth out. And um, from what I've heard, it, has, it is very difficult to take this out. And I must tell you, it really is. So what I actually ended up doing, I tried pulling the mouth out, then this piece in here snapped. And I used that to my advantage and um, thankfully it came out. Like this could bend out enough. I managed to chisel away enough glue to get the mouthpiece out so it didn't break. So this should actually go on really easily once I've got the uh, the gear replaced or the string or whatever's causing it not to work. Um, but yeah, can have a look, look, little look inside. I think, yeah, the motor shaft piece is in there. But yeah, that came off. Yeah, it is the motor shaft piece that the problem is. So I'm going to get that out. And uh, I just need to undo the staples, which these just flip pry out pretty much very similar to these are on a lot of jemmy items nowadays all well, back then they were on the avoiding bottles especially so yeah that is um that's where i'm at at this part of the project and yeah we'll get on to once his head's off so here we go here is james brown's head all fully off as you can see there's the head and this is the mouth mechanism as you can see it is very simple it is literally a spring which attaches to the top, which um, pulls this piece back up. And when the spring, when the motor turns, it'll pull the piece down. As you can see right there, I have uh, super glued the mechanism back together, um, which wasn't a problem after I um, <laughs> after I took this part the way I did. Um, but it's also good because the mouth actually does fit back on just very fine, um, which is very lucky because. As far as repairs of James Brown goes, um, well, at least the last one I repaired, um, it really wasn't as easy as this. Like, the mouth actually can break, um, so you've got to be very wary of that, or it can shatter. So, um, yeah, what I'm going to do now, I'm going to um, put them all back together. It should be all good as new. I'll show you in work, actually. <laughs> see everything works mouth works perfectly it's not working it intermittently anymore um so that's all good this gear should last long i have put a tentative gear on because obviously these uh, little um string gears uh, they aren't really hard to come across aren't really easy to come across much so uh tentative, tentative gears work, usually work fine on these so yeah i'm gonna put them back together and they'll seem fully working so who's james brown after all of his repairs and um, he's looking really good now. Um, I did pick this guy up off eBay for about £30, um, which wasn't a bad price at all, to be honest, for um, one in this condition. Um, it's, cosmetically, he's great. Like He's got the hands of air, because some do get the hands missing. Um, face is in good, good shape. Just everything, really. Um, it's just mainly the mechanics on this guy that needed fixing. Um, the James Brown air before this was completely fried out. The sound was fried. The only thing that really worked was the mouth and everything. But, um, the dancing was fried as well on that one. Um, but this one just is in a lot better shape. 
Um, so I'll go over the repairs needed, but what well, we've already done in the video, but I'll mention anyway. Um, hip swing um, had a split gear, um, which was very easy, and I've also replaced half the gearbox for that because of how yellowed it was. Um, the um, head turn also had a split gear. It still um, does. Um, it st still does unlock itself from the gears. I'm not sure if there's one gear. There you go. There's one gear of a missing tooth in there, but it does. Um, it does work fine apart from that. Um, you can't really see that. That's affecting it. And uh, finally, the mouth. The mouth was um, is notoriously known as the hardest fix on these pop culture characters. Um, this guy, it wasn't too bad, mainly because the mouth came off in one piece. It didn't snap. Um, but part of the mechanism inside did, but I've super glued it so it doesn't really, uh, so it hasn't really broken, uh, which is really good. Um, so yeah, everything works really good on this guy. Um, definitely the hardest fix is the mouth, I definitely do believe that, what everyone says. Um, so yeah, without any further ado then, I'll, uh, I'll give you guys a demo of James Brown. There you go, it looks really good. I'm very happy with this guy. Um, the mouth, um, once again, um, did have a split mouth, a split piece which was on the motor shaft. That was what's causing it not to work. Um, but yeah, that is everything for this video, guys. Please uh, leave any comment, any questions in the comments below. If um, you have any questions on how to fix this guy or um, just anything about this item in general. And uh, please give us a like on this video if you haven't already, and subscribe to the channel, and thank you for watching.